Welcome back to Pathologic 2. Last episode, I basically failed at day 11. Mark Immortel just kind of stopped the play because I didn't get as far as they wanted me to. So, this episode, I loaded the save where I actually started the last episode. So this is a do-over. There's a lot of things I can do to cut off a lot of the time that I ended up being ended up being kind of a waste. Just like in hindsight. I mean, it told me a lot about the characters talking with the Bachelor over here and Capella over here. And going up to the Polyhedron, that was really interesting to see. But now that I've done it and I know what that's all about, I can avoid them and save quite a few hours. So, 2.30 p.m. on day 11. I know that General Block, or well, General Block's trail starts here. <clears throat> So let's just do that right away. Um, I'm back to the point where I'm starving to death, however. So I think I'm going to go up to this boat here. Take it... Take it down to here. Stop by the Han's place to give them a immunity boost. And then head over here. That sounds good to me. What am I going to do about food, you ask? I don't know. Uh, let's take a Yas Plus. It'll give me uh, 10 seconds of breathing room. There's probably a cache here, right? I mean, the caches don't have food, though. The most they have are nuts. Eh, yeah. Ooh, a little shortcut that's not on the map. Shit, I need to get down there. Uh... Guess I just kind of... Gotta go around. Actually, let's go back. I don't want to go through the infected zone if I don't have to. This way? No. This way. Oh yeah, we had this conversation before. You on our side? Are you with the mutineers? Now in the time for mutinies. Evil does destroy itself, it seems. AKA, go fuck yourself. This boat over here is actually closer. That's Yulia's place. They're doing fine though. They don't need any help. to the Han's place. something good, a Medrol Plus. You should be fine.
It's so pretty. But I don't have time to admire it. Now over here. You the one who threw a bunch of rocks and dirt at me yesterday? We had this conversation too. Look like a kid flaying. No, every man for himself. Uh, let's say this instead of what I said the top one before. Let's say this one. Some wisdom. Wash your eyes well from the soil or you'll weep pus. That is disgusting. Dead soldiers, a lot of mutineers and, and infighting. Uh, I'm healthy. Mm hmm. Okay, crowstone. Man, I'm taking a lot of damage. Yeah, let's eat the nuts again. That's it. Last time I had some hazelnuts, I guess I looted them. Taking damage from hunger again. Yeah, nuts don't go very far. This is as far as I got. <laughs> yeah, wow, I've saved a lot of time, huh? This is as far as I got when I failed. I didn't have time to get over here. Okay, uh, we should stop at Sapa's place along the way. They're infected. Give them some treatment. You have any stuff I can loot? Like, food? Ah. Swiffery. Plus. Patient is in pain. Ooh. But it is a plus, and it's either bones or nerves, and I just used a nerves one, so it's probably bone. Yeah. You'll be fine. Let's 
go this way? Yeah. I'm just hoping I come across food. Yeah, that's pretty much my strategy. Just hope I come across food. Actually, I should go to the tavern. Which is where this is, right? Yeah. We're going to the tavern anyway. They'll sell some stuff for money, although I'm very poor, actually. I guess some of the soldiers actually try to, like, fortify this place and take refuge here. Jesus Christ. A lot of civilians, too. Damn, I'm taking a lot of damage. Oh, man, I hope the bartender's still working. You don't... You don't look like the bartender. Uh... No, these are bad people. Gang leader. Who are you? Artemy Burach. Another Burach. Funny meat sacks, you? So many Burachs around these days. What? I'm the only Burach around. Look over there at the stage. See? That's a Burach, too. He was running after the general with some papers, but his foot slipped. Now he's preparing for an operation gathering his thoughts. Here are my conditions. One of us got a bit punctured. A lovely soul, really. Very dear to me. So whoever fixes him is Burach in my book. Explain? Aren't you an educated man? Do I need to make myself even more clear? Yes. You'll extract the bullet. Don't worry about your gear, we got everything covered. Leftovers from your predecessor. Then you'll patch the hole. He's got enough of them. Well, either you do it or that clown will. If our pal survives, you're free to drag your sorry asses to that general of yours. If he doesn't, you're both dog food. Food for dogs, Burach. So he claimed to be Burach? I guess he really wanted to survive. And since he did, now he owes us. Where's the wounded? They won't let me talk to the courier until I patch up the bandit or force my way through. Wounded bandit. I don't have much experience with gunshot wounds. Common sense says I can't get the bullet out safely in these conditions, but I know the lines. Or at least I think I do. <clears throat> hmm. Give me the longest set of tweezers from the bag. He was shot in the stomach. That's bad news. He's almost a goner. The wounded is wearing a sweater and several shirts at once. Guess he was hoping the layers of cloth will protect him from sand pest. Um... Cut off the clothing and obstructs the wound. The wound doesn't look good at all. A ricocheting rifle round by the looks of it. But I feel like he has a chance. Hmm. This is a very interesting, like, mini-game. God, I hope I don't fuck it up. Um, clean the wound with alcohol. 
The patient's breath gets hoarse. He's gurgling and wheezing. Hmm. Calm the patient down with my left hand firmly immobilize his head. Shouldn't have done that. He's wheezing and struggling even harder. There's still a chance. Okay, buddy, calm down. We can get through this. It looks like the wound is less dangerous than it first seemed. The bullet didn't go in deep enough to do major damage. However, the wound is contaminated with pieces of dirty cloth. Time to drain the wound with some cleaner cloth. Something hard inside. Hmm. Something small. A bone fragment? I don't think so. Not in the stomach. Metal. That's the bullet. Come here, little thing. Uh, pull it out. Steadily. It's... It's done. Clean the wound again, then apply bandages. Easy stuff. If he lives, I'd like to talk to him when he feels a bit better. Damn, I did it. Time to talk to the courier. Hello, Burrah. Hard to me, Burrah. <laughs> the resemblance is striking. It's not. You look nothing like me. I'm talking about myself. The resemblance is striking. It's like I'm the real thing. <laughs> what are you doing here? I was looking for the courier, same as you. The day is the day in which the Haruspex looks for the courier. What the fuck is going on? Who are you, man? Why do you call yourself Burrah? I'm your successor. I don't want a successor, I'm not over yet. I'm a new actor. Your successor, so to speak. A continuation of you. A new actor is only hired when the old one's dead. Or has this rule changed? It's all very confusing now. The director washed his hands of this whole business. Said we're on our own. No script at all. But I got paid in advance, so here I am. Doing the work I'm supposed to do. What in the hell? So is this only happening? Because I messed up the day? Would they not be here if I didn't mess up the day? Paid in advance, and here I am working for free. Leave me be, human. I'll be of use to you yet. I stand between you and death as your successor. Hmm. Thing is, I don't like you. Your performance is terrible. I'm completely different. Are you sure? Who knows? Never hurts to take a good look at yourself. I'm sure. I succeed you. Don't hurt me, human. I'm your mirror. Don't kill me. I'm your guide to immortality. As you die, I'll succeed you. What? I embarked on your path in advance to make sure the thread doesn't snap. I walked in your footsteps. I've been to the river, spoken with a changeling, seen the soldiers in the fog. What have you done to them, by the way? Did you shoot or run? Anyway, I don't hinder you at all, but I have made a new connection. You love connections, don't you? What kind of connection? You and I are connected, both alive, both playing the same person simultaneously. That means we've defeated it. What's so bad about that? Playing? Are you kidding? I'm the real thing, the actual person, the one and only. Like I said, I'm your successor. If you die, I'll continue in your place. Seriously, I'm starting to think I understand the director's vision better than you do. Where's the courier? Were you after him? My stage direction went like this. Today, the Eurospex looks for the courier. Barach tries to ambush him so that he doesn't deliver orders to the general. So I tried to kill him, and failed. <laughs> Your directions were misleading. That's not what I'm planning to do. I couldn't finish him off. 
My arms are weak. You never got the hang of this whole fighting thing. I have to pay for that since I'm your successor. No hard feelings, though. I guess doctors don't really need that skill. But if you were a better fighter, the courier wouldn't be on the run now. I don't need a successor. Don't replace, duplicate, or cover for me. I'm the only person named Artemi Burah. The only one with his burden. You're not here. I am Isidore Gassar. I follow in Artemi Burah's footsteps, trying my best to study him. That's all I want. So, can we go our separate ways? Hmm. I almost want to kill them, <laughs> just because they're creepy as hell, but... <sighs> like, why though? I'll be the one to succeed you. And now I'm off to find the courier. No wonder the bandits were so surprised and saying there's so many Artemi Paras these days. Yes, <laughs> there are. <laughs> so weird. Okay, but where do I go now? Wait, where do I go now? There's nothing marked on the map anymore. I mean, there's the other... Uh, the other, what are they called, outposts to look at, but we already went there before. Would they go to one of those? After leaving here? I... Fuck if I know. Alright then. murmur waiting for you waiting for you tell us tell us now will you fulfill your duty sign by na hatonge what do you want to tell me bite haran upshe stands at our doorstep a big loss all that remains of us is here before you I know, there are few of you left. You need her blood. If you let blood out of Earth, Mother Boda will die. Is that what you want? Polish, Polish, by Alish. I mean... No, but we need to remove it to save the Earth, but removing it's going to cause the Earth to bleed to death? I... What do I do? That's the opposite of what I want. If Mother Bodo dies, so do we. Zobalon. Buzar. Laha. It hurts. It frightens us. So few remain. It's not so terrible to die, but what about losing something for all time? Earth is killing us. Mother Bodo devours her children. She disgorged this horrible plague, so her blood will erase it. All is connected. All is as it should be. Take pity on us. <laughs> I like one of the options, right? There's there's ones that are just kind of understanding and nuanced, and then there's just... I really need that blood. I do. Behara, M. Shen chooses words carefully. Who is to judge him? But, but... Take pity on us. What do you want from me? Take pity on us, Aseger. Kill not our mother. How? I mean, just let the plague happen? Just don't try to stop it? 
just let Mother Bodo continue to have an arrow stuck into their chest, almost reaching the heart? Beche, I refuse. I cannot do it your way. Then this is our goodbye. Bayate Emshem. Bayatai Asayir. Bayatai Kolbun. Bayatai Hayala. Bayatai Hatange. Oshish Da. Go. Sorry. One courier is still out there bleeding. If the papers reach General Block, living Earth will die forever, along with all its wonders. I have to do it. I really feel like I have to do it. Just... can't just leave all the people in this town and possibly the world if the plague manages to spread further. It, just to die. Is that partner? No hair? It might be. It's hard to tell. Still out there bleeding. <laughs> Where? Fucking hell. Okay, um, I'm gonna head to the shady shop to see if I can afford some sort of food. Could just take a quick rummage around one of these houses to see if I could get some things to sell. Necklaces and whatnot. Um, do I have stuff to trade for uh, with the kids? I have three beetles, some marbles. Sometimes I like fishing hooks. I might be able to get some food from the kids. Wish I didn't eat my nuts. That's my last bandage. The only thing you want are marbles. Shit. Ah, you don't have any food, but you do trade for a much wider array of things. Might be a good idea to get some shotgun ammo. Yeah. Shotgun ammo for fishing hooks? Heck yeah. Anyway, I'm still dying. Shitty shop time. Out of curiosity, can I... I can take out a weapon in here. Could I kill the shady shop owner? I guess there'd be no way to even get back there if I did, which is... Oh. Oh. Right. Okay. Toast. 
That'd be a reasonable amount of food. Just need to sell a little something. Like what? Some revolver ammo? Yeah. Okay, yeah, that'll have to do. Where now? I guess just one of these courier places? Yeah. Alright, um, I should take a boat. Is that? This boat's not an infected district. It's right next to it, but it isn't in it. This one's right next to this place, so might as well go there and then take this boat down here. That sounds good. Time is getting kind of limited. Even with all my time shortcuts. I'm running out of time. I don't know if this even will advance... You know, to me, finding the courier, I doubt it, but I, what else can I do? So, I'm going to go through this conversation again. Okay, had the conversation. Um, unfortunately, I can't take this boat back because it's in an infected district, but there's another boat just a little bit over here. How am I doing on time? I have two hours left. That's not much time. I gotta go do the Clara thing. Okay, just took the boat. That, <laughs> that leaves me with an hour and ten minutes. Unless I'm going to find the courier there, I don't think that's going to cut it. Maybe I'm meant to fail. Maybe I'm meant to not be able to find the courier, because how the fuck am I supposed to find them? So many corpses, what happened here? Where's the courier? <sighs> yeah, I don't think this is going to be different. One courier is still alive, he's wounded, where could he be? That popped up after I... ...just, uh, talked with the changeling. How am I supposed to find them? Okay, I loaded my save game from just after I had the conversation with the other art to me. At the Broken Heart. I have an idea. They said that they're bleeding somewhere, so maybe there's a blood trail to follow? Oh, right, we gotta have this conversation. Okay. Conversation had. Now, let's grab a candle stub and an empty bottle and look for some... blood? I mean, it's raining, am I... <laughs> am I really gonna find any blood when it's fucking raining? <sighs> if there isn't any right outside the door, where would it be? This doesn't bode well. It sounded like a good idea. I have a new idea. How about I chug a bunch of Twyrine and hope that the town tells me where I should go? Let's just take them all. Oh, I think Goliath just died. Okay, where did it highlight? I mean, that's a cache. That's a cache, that's a cache, that's a cache. These two, I don't know. Possibly not. Let me head over to them.
On my way over there, I actually have a new idea. If someone's hurt, perhaps they would go to the pharmacy? Trying to look for bandages and stuff? And there's one right across from the broken heart. Let's try it. Feels far-fetched. Everything feels far-fetched. I don't know what to do, honestly. Nope. Marked place number one. Please don't be a cash. Ah, it's a cash. And the other one is a cash as well. <laughs> Maybe they would try to go to the town hall with the orders. Going into the town hall. I doubt they're going to be here. Really, really doubt they're going to be here. Yeah, there's nothing here. Well, I went to have the conversation with the other Artemy again to see if there's any clues to the courier's whereabouts that I missed. And I kind of accidentally chose the option that makes them try to kill me because I basically say that, hey, I'm going to kill you. So I just shot them. Do they have anything on them? A rusty scalpel, some hazelnuts and some brown twire. Well, that's not helpful. I thought I would check the cathedral. I don't really know why, but... Um, Aglaia isn't here. They just died, actually. <laughs> I can talk to Bad Grief, though. The tower. Be a shame if it collapsed, since, you know, kids. <laughs> Yet they, too, are controlled by someone. Insane to think what kind of teeth you need for that. What? Where's Aglaia? Uh, I mean, the Inquisitor. Like, the Commissar. Relax. I can see she's just an ordinary human to you. Where did she go, Grief? Snap out of it for a second. She sent three people up to the general to deliver orders of some kind. Then she left herself, too. After them, I guess. To our blighted headquarters. Where else? She went on her own? Nah, she just sent them a portrait of herself. Of course she went on her own. Are you alright in the head, Cub? What orders did she send? Just the orders? Something about the bombardment? It's not like she reports to me. I just keep my eyes on the ball. It's about the polyhedron, I think. It bothers her. Sometimes it even seems like that's why she came to the town at all. You know how it is with them. There's always a mask behind the mask. Uh... Do you have anything here to eat? An idiot, are you? I'm feasting on my former sins. I'm far from starvation. Great. Well, see you. <laughs> Sit with me, brother. Hmm? I mean it. Come on. Sit. They're dragging you down your path, so don't go. Imagine how shocked they'll be when you don't listen. No one drags me. I make my own choices. Don't go. Let them break their fingers. Or are you just a puppet? Ah, that's it. I've had enough of your puppet talk. Okay, well, I have to admit, I'm confused. I don't know what to do. I really don't. I don't know how to find this person. So, I'm going to end this episode here, and in the meantime... Give it a good old hard think. <laughs>